Two organizations are coming together to give and take. United Way and the Alabama Power Service Organization are setting up little free libraries. The decorative boxes are filled with books for children, teens, and adults. People are encouraged to take a book and leave a book. President of United Way of East Central Alabama, Shannon Jenkins, says it's a great way to keep students reading during school breaks. We know that in some of our outlying areas, it's difficult with transportation to get to your, uh, your, your public library uh, when your schools are closed, maybe during those long holidays. Uh, and having these little free libraries in those communities will give those children an opportunity to just drop by and get a book when they don't have access to their school library um, to read over those periods of time. The organizations will be putting up a total of six little free libraries. Aniston Operations Engineer Supervisor Brian Doyle tells us that the program makes it easier for everyone to have access to we books. We understand that literacy is very important and we understand that sometimes access to books is difficult and having these little free libraries they might look like a birdhouse at first glance but really there's children's books and adults books inside and we hope that make the libraries will be easy access for people to get free books and to encourage reading. Now the partners stress that literacy is important for people of all ages.